Hey everyone, uh, welcome back to, well, it's Freedom City 1165 in Surviving Mars Below and Beyond. Right, well, some stuff is happening, right? War tensions are over 50% in the uh, mystery. Uh, we're at 15% temperature. Um, right, so... Uh, where are we? Uh, I can't remember where, where it was at here. Uh, we have... Okay, right. I was getting production sorted out. That's what I was doing. Okay. We got uh, Logi uh, um, tunnel supports, so that's good. Uh, so let's just check in on the um, research. So uh, we've got um, advanced gravity maneuvers. So when we do go to asteroids, it will be more efficient. Uh, underground flight school, so we can have uh, shuttles underground. And extended cargo modules, which will make going to and from asteroids a little less um, annoying. Um, right. Now. Um, no. Um, no, that's... That one might be good to get. Um, this one is going to be important. Um, but I think prefab refab. Um, see this? Um, this allows us to take buildings down and then put them up again somewhere else, right? And that's, um, that's a very useful um, ability. And that's why I'm going to go for that one first. So, um, we do have a billion, so we can outsource uh, some uh, research here. The money is not useful for much of anything at the moment anyway, since uh, resupply on Earth is kind of pointless. So, let's just do that, and that'll knock uh, a sixth of this out in the next uh, five sols, right? So... Uh, right, so we'll do that. Meanwhile, we'll let uh, our resources accumulate. Uh, right, and then we can just wait for the uh, tensions on Earth to do whatever they're going to do. Now, um, do we have anything here that is worth... Uh, we could, we could ca uh, capture meteors. Um... Yeah, we could. Um, let's just contact China and see if there's anything. Nano refinement. Well, we can get the atomic accumulators. Okay. Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Um, now, if this isn't a competitive thing, right? So uh, you don't have to worry about trading tech to your competitors uh, generally. Um, yeah, we're gonna we're gonna capture meteors, uh, just because uh, that just seems like the sort of thing that we might want to do. Now, uh, now that we have atomic accumulators, that might be something that's worth building. So if we go in here, um, they take po two polymers maintenance, just concrete and polymers. Okay, well. Um, I think it might be worth putting maybe a couple, maybe a couple of these things up. Uh, now you still want to have a few of the regular kind of batteries because they uh, charge faster uh, per uh, volume, right? But I can stick this in, say here, and uh, once it builds then you can uh, see what, uh, why it would be a, a good thing. So if you take a look at these, they will discharge a maximum of 20, right? Uh, these discharge 100, right? So one of these can, per, can supply five times the instantaneous demand. And that's, um, that's kind of what we want there, right? And it's f uh, five times the demand uh, and substantially less um, a maintenance for the total storage capacity. 
right? Okay, I haven't been running this at uh, regular speed with the shuttles and everything going on for quite a while here. Um, right, okay. Now, we have in here, we have lots of people in here. Um, we have some that are unemployed. Right, our farms are only... Uh, oh, we're, we're training people. Okay, that's um, that's definitely going to, uh, to help some things. Actually, that's a good reason to have the spire in that dome, actually. The... Uh, 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 the what you would call it, arcology, right? Um, okay. Now we need to get these numbers up quite substantially, uh, especially the uh, machine parts. Now, why? Because when I finally research mohole, uh, we're going to need lots of those to build that. Um, now, if we look in here. Um, right no it's um here no here no um no we haven't researched any wonders yet okay um right well we need lots of uh, machine parts and and metal and everything to to build all of that stuff right okay now this is built so it stores 10 times the uh, capacity for twice the maintenance and it can output five times the capacity so uh, if we so five of these guys can supply the hundred demand uh, but they only store 1500 power right um, so, this guy, uh, and, and it can only charge at 50, right? Uh, these guys can charge at, um, I think they charge at, uh, at 100. Uh, they charge faster as well. Uh, so, and they need 10% capacity, both of them, before they will uh, start... Um, uh, supplying the grid, right? So, is that's under the... Uh, yeah, it is. Okay. So, I think it might be worth putting a second one up. So, if I put it... No, that's not going to fit there. Um, I could put it just in the middle here. Yeah, I could put another one in the middle of all of those. Uh, the whole idea, have it under the tribos, and uh, it's not going to cost any maintenance, right? Except during uh, dust storms. Uh, right, because we, we've got 100 spare power here, right? Uh, so we can, uh, we can charge it at uh, pretty close to uh, full, full speed, right? Uh, so this one will start, uh, yeah, yeah, it's in range of the tri tribo, so... Um, good. So here we're producing seven machine parts using six. Uh, we're producing eight using four. Uh, we're producing five using five. Hmm. That's, um, uh, a little bit of a problem. Okay. Right. Well, let's, uh, kick up the, uh, the speed here. And uh, yeah, we'll get uh, we'll get some more stuff going on here. Uh, we have 185 uh, uh, people, but 38 of them are Earthborn, and that could turn out to be a problem. No, wait, do I have births? Yeah, births are allowed here. What's the uh, comfort? 88. Uh, births allowed here. Uh, yeah, comfort 90. Births allowed here. Uh, comfort, 89. Yeah, so we should have a, a pretty solid birth rate here. Uh, we have 24 children. So our nurseries are full. Okay. Well, I think it might be... 
might be worth um, going ahead and creating a couple more nurseries. Well, one more, anyway. Now you... Uh-huh. Okay. And you... Right. Okay. You are full. Um, needed three botanists, ten engineers, ten geologists, medics. Okay, right. 52% uh, war tension. Right. Okay, that's so far so good. Um, yeah. Okay, so this is going up. That's good. Um, hmm. Oh, it's because we don't have enough uh, enough people working there. Okay. Ah. Uh, last war. It has begun. Uh, the moment that seemed unthinkable less than a year ago. Regional conflict, etc., etc., etc. So far, no nukes. Um, uh, doomsday clock sits in the dark. Uh, warning fallen on deaf ears, etc. All rockets are unavailable due to chaos on Earth. War never changes. Right. Okay, so uh, we can't resupply at all and we can't um, we can't export either. So, yeah. Now we have here a celebrity that's uh, ticking the uh, the funding up a little bit. Um, that's fine. Um, it is interesting that the outsourcing is still uh, functioning. Uh, that does seem like it might be a bit of an oversight, but it might just be just simplification for the mechanics. And who knows, maybe we're outsourcing to somebody else and uh, they're still a... Well, uh, they're able to uh, possibly, uh, you know, type beam the stuff to us, or maybe it's the other colony or something like that has taken it up, right? Uh, so, you know, hard to say. Anyway, uh, we, we have 31 of these kicking about, right? These are going up. That is good that those are going up. Um, we only have 181. Uh, okay. We have 25 children. Well, 24 now. Okay, we are... Uh, the population is going up. Uh, as long as it doesn't happen like happened to me in one game that I played offline, where I ended up with uh, a, a string of births that were all female. No males. And as a result... I ended up with a non-fertile population. Believe it or not, and I was playing with Last Ark, so I couldn't import more people, and I didn't get lucky and get a uh, refugee rocket or something like that. So, uh, believe it or not, I was able to save that game uh, because I got a breakthrough at just the right time. The cloning vats breakthrough. Now, uh, getting that just in time that I could research it, build the cloning vats, because I had just enough population to run it long enough to create some clones. And the, uh, the clones are fertile, and even though they only live half as long, they do produce children that are regular Martian-born. And that allowed me to get... I also got Forever Young. And uh, uh, I think I combined that with Forever Young. And that gave bought me just enough time to uh, rebuild the population. Um, I think I also had researched bio-robots. Uh, and uh, I may... Now, that's the other thing. If you can research bio robots, you can uh, also um, uh, make sure that you're, uh, as long as you're feeding your colony, 
that you always have a workforce, right? And um, but they're expensive to make, and uh, yeah, that was uh, so that wasn't an option, right? But I got the uh, the clones happening, and I got find my streak broke, and I had some male clones and a couple female ones, and they started having children. It took about 20 sols, but the population recovered. Uh, and that was all before the mystery fired. So uh, if anyone tells you that the uh, cloning vats, um, <laughs> if the cloning vats uh, uh, breakthrough is totally useless, it's not. Um, it's situationally useful. It's generally useless, though. Right, okay, so, uh, well, this is going up, but, huh, yeah, so we need some time to pass here. Now, we're about a quarter done with the uh, prefab, refab, ah, our meteor storm, uh, right, uh, where are they? Okay. So they're not going to get um, zapped by uh, the uh, lasers. Now I'm kind of hoping for um, uh, anomalies for uh, science, right? But it also will potentially get us metals. Okay, yeah, see, that's exactly what I was hoping for. Oh, drat, it's an electrostatic dust storm. Those things are nasty. Um, right, so our, um, our guy here is coming. Oh, both of our guys are coming there. Um, eh, we just got a Saul in a bit here. Um, oh, right, I should just, uh, pause it here and go and land the rocket, shouldn't I? Okay, so we can land the rocket there. Uh, right, okay. Now, we can come down here and just watch the uh, um, rovers so that they don't get uh, clobbered, right? Uh, have I researched... Uh, I haven't researched rover printing yet. Okay, but I might need to do that if the ro rovers get clobbered, right? On the upside, you do get some resources if you have to scrap them. Um, right. Uh, okay, we are now researching a uh, anomaly. Um, right. Um, okay, we're halfway done with it. Uh, that's the thing about the uh, meteor anomalies. They're always a science uh, anomaly, right? So, right. Uh, what are we... Uh, okay. 1250. Okay, well, that, uh, that kicked it up a little bit. Um, okay. And... And these things have moved on over here. Okay. Oh. And we got another anomaly. Two from one meteor storm. That's uh that's kind of uh kind of impressive actually. Um you know what? We have plenty of fuel. Let's uh go up here, find the um yeah, and uh, we'll uh, send Magnum back up uh, for that. Okay, now back over here. Just uh, observe the uh, rovers again. Ah, that was a close one. Uh, okay. Oh, he's going to drop off up there. Okay. Um, 
right. Okay. Well, that was a big one. Uh, okay, yeah. Well, that's kind of uh, where to go. Oh. Oh, he's right there. Okay. Um, oh, we got 1,000 out of that anomaly. So that's 2,500. Uh, so that's two and a half souls. Uh, no, 2,500. Um, one twelfth. Um, yeah, it's one twelfth of the uh, research. So, yeah. Um, nine hours left. Uh, we could get another anomaly pop up. Uh, otherwise, I'm going to park the guy over there. Right. Uh, yeah, park him over here under the uh, laser. Uh, yeah, that's probably smart. Oh, something I should probably do... Uh, Wait, no machine parts over here. Uh, hmm. Yeah, that's going to be a uh, slight problem. Uh, maybe we can get one more anomaly out of this uh, storm? No, probably not. Uh, yeah, that's the last ones. There we go. Storm over. And we got a sol in a bit for the uh, uh, for the uh, uh, electrostatic storm. Uh, okay. Um, right. Where are you? You're heading over that way. Okay. Right. Now. Uh, we have unemployed people. Hmm. Well, um... Wait, we have... We have 38 residential slots open. Um... You know what might... Uh, be a smart thing to uh, to do. Stick my other arcology up over here. Rocket Star Killer couldn't take it anymore. Uh, low sanity. Ah. Uh, right. Okay. Well, that's fine. Um, <clears throat> now, uh, when are we going to get the? Uh, Hmm. Is there another mass... Is there a second refugee rocket in this mystery? Uh, I can't remember. Okay, so that is... Uh, okay, so that's uh, running more. That's These guys are running... Uh, oh. Okay. Uh, metals. I could... I could do this. Yeah, I should probably do that. Yeah. Um, that guy's full. That guy's full. Okay. Yeah. Okay, we're producing enough of those that exporting them becomes possible. Um... Yeah, okay. So we'll be able to do that when uh, when it becomes possible. Um, right. Uh, 13 hours, 12 hours for the electrostatic storm. So that's, um, that's good. Uh, you, you're a safari. I don't need the safari, do I? Um, why don't I take the safari and park it over here? 
No, it's over here. Yeah. Park it there. Okay. Uh, if I park it there, um, I can take it apart uh, and get the... Uh, uh, it's metals and uh, electronics I think you get from taking it apart. Um, and I can always build another one if I need it. But since uh, we can't collect tourists, there's not much point, right? Uh, three sols for the uh, meteor uh, storm. Right, and in here, yeah, we don't have machine parts here. Uh, right. Uh, okay. Uh, China's no longer offering metals for food. Uh, and the storm is here. So these guys are going to uh, run out of... Uh, yeah, they're going to run out. Um, right. Uh, this is something also. The uh, Trebos can't keep up with these storms in the um, uh, high difficulty mode. Uh, so... Um, so that's not... Uh, Oh, we have a leak. I should deal with that. Uh, right. Uh. Okay, so if we go in here and we do salvage the leak right and then we go no uh, we go in here and we cancel the salvage yeah um, right then we go in in here and here right pipes uh, build a new pipe right okay um, right uh, the, we've got how long do we have left on the storm two and a half sols okay uh, we've got a electric leak and we're going to go over to the safari and we're going to oh five metals five polymers okay um that's not going to help us all that much these things are going to fail yeah okay Now, do we have, uh, we have a couple of drones there, so it's just a matter of having power. Right. Actually, do I have power underground here? Um, no. Because this guy is... Uh-huh. Okay. Um, right. Because I don't have enough of uh, this stuff to... Uh, to bring the, uh, the stuff down yet. Ah, okay. Cassiopeia Red World. Okay, we got another another leak. Oh, that's cute. Um, okay. Uh, salvage here. Uh, then we go in here. Yeah. Build another one. Yep. Oh, we have another leak. That's power. 
Uh, where is it? Where is the fault? Um, I can't see the the leak. Um, yeah, I'm sure uh, all one of you that's watching is uh, uh, is shouting at me on where it is. But I just don't see it. Uh, where is it? I should be able to see the leak, right? But I don't. Yeah. Ah. There it is. Okay. Because it took me to the wrong place. Okay. So we go in here, um, do our thing again, salvage, where's the leak? Right there, okay. Uh, do this thing again, pipes, uh, it was here, locking objects, really? Okay. Uh, we'll do that. Okay, and there we go. Yep. Uh, so far, so good. Uh, that got rid of the uh, pipe leaks. Uh, we've got uh, one saw and a bit left. Right. Um, this is a regular meteor storm. Uh, right. Okay, we've got another meteor. Oh, we got a meteor storm happening now. Okay. Uh, China wants to trade, but we can't trade right now because there's no way to send a rocket pipe leak there it is uh, grab this uh, yep yeah. grab this okay we've completed the capture meteors uh, the rocket won't be able to land until the dust storm's done Okay, there we go. The pipe is... Oh, we got another leak. Where? Uh, oh, it's over there. Okay. Uh, so we can do that. No, and then we can go in here. Uh, pipes. Just like that. Yep. Uh, are these? The triples are keeping up with, with the uh, electrostatic storm. Okay. Okay, so I'm using delete as the shortcut there. But you got to make sure the mouse is pointing in the right place when you do it. Or you're going to end up deleting something you don't intend to. Um... Yeah, so, so you want to avoid that, right? Um, oh, we've got another... That's a power leak. Ah. Uh-huh. Um, pipe. Okay. Okay. 
Okay, now we're leaking uh, power. Okay. Um, right. Uh, we've got... Uh, um, we've got one saw left on this business. Uh, that's a little bit annoying, but it is what it is. Yeah, we're down to fifth. Yeah, okay, we were leaking power. Now, not so much. And uh, 23 hours left. So we're uh, in the meteor storm. Uh, meteor oh, really? Uh, if we come back up here, uh, we can see the uh, meteors are hitting down here. And that's fine. Uh, you. Disabled due to lightning strike. Ah. Right. Okay, so that's why nothing was in the way there. Okay. Uh, if we jump up here. Let's just take a boo over here. Um, yeah, okay. Um, this guy's going to quit working before the dust storm ends. Uh, that'll be annoying. Yep, there we go. Uh, knew it was going to do that. I should really have a... Uh, um, I really should have one of these over here that I keep closed. Yeah. Now, uh, where's the, uh, you can come over here. Right. Um, now where's the, uh, oh, it's because of the underground entrance. Okay. Well, we don't need to worry about that too much. Uh, right. Uh, half a saw left on the uh, dust storm. Yeah. Uh, so I think everything should be okay. Yeah, as if you uh, if you keep the uh, Sterling generator closed, it doesn't take damage, right? So it doesn't take dust damage. So you can uh, keep power operating um, even when uh, when there's a lot of um, uh, extra damage from the dust storm, right? Um, leak. Uh, ah, okay, there it is. Okay, now, again, we build a new pipe. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, so far so good. Um, right. Uh, and we've got it over there, right? Yeah. So, uh, pulling back to the overview map is a great way to reorient it so that you're, uh, you're facing the right way. Oh, we've got a, uh, pipe leak here. Okay. Uh, okay, do this. Yep, okay. Okay, so far so good. Yep. Uh, fuel depot got hit. Um, yep. Where's the pipe leak? Um, uh, 
Yeah, I, I, I don't see it. Um, right, well, whatever, wherever it was, it's fixed. And... Oh, we lost a, uh, a drone. Uh, where's the drone? Okay, well, lost drone. Um, yeah, I don't have a, uh, thingy there. Um, right, that's fine. Uh, capture meteors, planetary anomalies, resources... Research progress with a safari. <laughs> that would have been... Uh, you know what? We're going to do that one. Send. Uh, because we have a safari. Uh, planetary anomalies, yeah. Uh, and you are going to do a thing there. Yep. Uh, and a thing there. Uh, do I have a... I do have a laser there. Yeah. Okay, good. Um, right. Uh, that's why we have... Why I have the laser, right? Now, uh, pop out here. Uh, go in here. Land the rocket. Uh, pop out here, go in over here, right, okay, so this guy uh, can generate its uh, power, which will force everything there to, uh, to operate, okay, good, uh, we can now pop out here, come back over here, uh, now, uh, we have 185 uh, people. Uh, yeah. Okay, we have some Earthborn people that are uh, are going away, but, you know, that's to be expected. Um, so I'll ride out the uh, meteor storm here. Uh, we got 4,000 science from that uh, anomaly, so uh, that's, uh, that's really good. Uh, prefab refab should be useful. Uh, uh, if we ever want to, uh, so we can, you know, you know if, if I want to take the, uh, solar panels down, I can, uh, I can just, um, I, I can just, uh, uh, refab or prefab them and, uh, put them up elsewhere or store them for taking to, um, to, um, the, um, um, Asteroids, yeah, that, that's what they are. Uh, you can also shunt them to other maps, like to the um, underground, and put them up that way. Uh, that one's going to get zapped. Or not. That one should get zapped. Yep. Yeah. These guys have a uh, cycle time on them as well. Um, uh you oh right uh renegade vegan yeah uh that's going to break the uh yep uh and you uh oh no <laughs> Rebuilt that. <laughs> yeah. Uh, so that killed a drone. Okay. Well, we'll salvage the drone. Um, meteors. Uh, see, that would be fine if it hit there. But no. Uh, of course, uh, we will drop the rocket. Um, yeah, see, it'd be fine if they hit there, right? But no, of course, it zaps that one. Um, 
So that's why it's a good idea to have a couple of those covering everywhere, right? Now, how you're running a full, you're running full. You're stopped and you're stopped. We have here no unemployed people there. Okay. Right. Now, these guys are full. That's good. Right. Um, what's the uh, overall situation? Okay, so this guy is running not quite full. That guy is running a full set of shifts. We are uh, producing less metals than we actually need to. Uh, right. But we've got 426 of them. Um, yeah, uh, okay. So you, do we have any, any open, um, call it, we have open living spots down here. So I could open, uh, these, uh, slots up. Yeah. Um, uh, rockets from Earth are available once again. Resources are still unavailable. Uh, right. Okay. How do we have... We have three celebrities now? Wow. Wow. Uh, so I could actually send an export rocket down to Earth, back to Earth now. Yeah, uh, that might be uh, that might be useful. Uh, I could put these on heavy workload, but I don't think that's exactly smart. Uh, we have here twenty six of thirty six. Hmm. Uh, vacant work slots four. I could open up. Hmm. I could put an apartment down here. Um, yeah, I'm gonna do that. Okay, and we're gonna need homes, apartments. Okay, so we've got to let that get destroyed. Yep. Okay, there we go. Put that in there. Okay, so that will... Uh, that will bring up the uh, capacity of the, of the dome a little bit, and then... Uh, Then we'll be able to have, um, well, just uh, more people down here. And uh, uh, we have, yeah. Okay, have more people down here. Uh, and that will... Uh, yeah, so... So that'll give us uh, another 10. Um, and that, I think, is probably enough to... Um, uh, get the... Uh, uh, yeah, okay, we got 24 vacant residential slots there. Right, it'll take a minute for, for all of that to uh, to fill in. Right. Uh, okay. Yeah, it's starting to now. Uh, so that one... Yeah, so we're getting the people back to work those. Good. Okay. Well, we got a cold wave coming. So I think that's a good time to um, 
to just um, put the cut in. And uh, yeah, so next episode, I think we'll, we'll get this up high enough that we'll start shuttling stuff down to the underground. And that will, uh, that will allow some uh, stuff to actually start happening down there. Anyway, uh, that's going to be all for this time. So I'll just mention I have a Patreon if you are interested in supporting the channel. It's entirely optional, so if you don't want to, don't. Uh, I, I won't feel bad one way or the other. It's just there. And I guess that said, uh, that's all for now. So see you back next time.